Hi everyone, Kevin Raver here and welcome to the Daily Chat. Today I'm at the Indianapolis Art Center in the Digital Imaging Studio where I'm an artist in residence. I have all my printers here and this is where I teach the printing classes. And I just want to talk to you today about photo tins. If you've been reading this site for any length of time, you know that I'm a big fan of projects and you don't always have to print big. And one of the ways I like to print is a collection of photographs. I call them projects. You can see right here, for example, this is a photo tin. Uh, they're made by Hanemuel. Oh, you'll find the links in the article and in the, the uh, description below. And by the way, while I'm talking about this, thinking about this, uh, please hit the subscribe button and you can hit the bell button too. I would like to get to uh, at least 5,000 subscribers sometime in the very near future. I know it's not a lot, but hey, I'm just starting up the YouTube portion of this site and it would be really great if you could help me out. I appreciate it. We have a lot more viewers than we do subscribers, but uh, it would be great if you would subscribe. I'd appreciate it. Any case, this is a five by eight um, Hanemuel uh, photographic Paper. I think it's uh, the Burrito Papers, and uh, there's a number of different paper surfaces you can get from Hanamule to do it. Uh, this is on the Palouse Hospital. Um, you can see I did an article about this uh, on the site not too long ago. Today I want to share with you the recent project I did, and it's the Bears of Katmai. Uh, a couple years ago I went to Katmai, Alaska with Art Wolf, and uh, we photographed as part of the week-long adventure there. Uh, bears, um, and it was quite a nice. So you can see it comes into this beautiful tin like this, and you open it up and you're presented with uh, 30 images. And uh, I have one image that I've done as a title uh, image. And from there, you can bring the pictures out. And you can see there's 30 really great images in here. And what's really cool about these images is the paper is really nice. I believe this was the burrito paper I used, or, or the rag, I, I'd have to look on my notes here. But there's uh, quite a few of them, and I do have quite a few tins, and quite a few projects still to do. But when I look through these, I'm just kind of looking at the quality. Now what I did was I went back as a new Lightroom user, and you, many of you know that I was Capture One for a while, and I've converted over to Lightroom. I went back and I've uh, been working over a number of my different projects and what's really nice about Lightroom now is that I can mask subject, mask background, and I can make really easy adjustments because the masking tools are so good. And essentially what I did was I went back and reworked all these images. And uh, there, this one for example is uh, quite spectacular. This is just a bear standing in the creek by himself. Then I have the two cubs followed by Mama and her three cubs, and uh, quite a few of those. And then just the bears running in the water, especially when they're catching the salmon like this. Uh, quite fun, quite, <laughs> quite a lot of fun to photograph. Uh, you're a lot closer to the bears than you really might want to be. But it was a, a good project. You can take a look at the images here. Uh, I'll kind of put them up as a quick slideshow. And uh, if you want, you can hit the pause button anywhere along the line so you can view them in detail. And <laughs> just want to let you know that you know, when you print one of these, I just kind of set the printer off to my side here, stick a piece of paper and make the print. Um, I work with uh, image print doing these. You could work with Lightroom or Epson Print Layout or any number of different um, uh, softwares to make these happen. But anyway, this is what I did and I'm really proud of this project. It sits on the coffee table at home now and uh, this is what I'm working on. I've got one on Rust I'm working on, one on Abstracts, and two on the best of, where some of the best images that I've uh, done over the last few years. So just wanted to say, work on a project that's a long weekend coming up, have some fun, enjoy yourself, work on your images, then get a couple of these tins and have fun making pictures. This is Kevin Raber on The Daily Chat. I'll see you next week. Just so you know, I'm taking a holiday off.